we're having a lazy, 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 lazy day and I'm so excited. Hey, hey, hey guys. I kind of wanted to film like a little reset routine and I'm not on TikTok but I've also seen the that girl routine all over Instagram and Pinterest and YouTube and I thought it'd be kind of fun to like combine the two because like I know that that girl routine to me just kind of looks like a glorified morning routine um, and I'm not here to say that you know you have to drink lemon water and work out every morning to have a productive day but I think it would just be like a good kickstart for me to try and like get back into some sort of routine but for me I think like a good day always kind of starts with like a good evening you know I'm not gonna go out I'm gonna have an early night gonna make myself some nice food and chill out watch some Netflix watch Love Island um and yeah I thought I'd just take you guys along we're getting real cozy in here the sweatshirt's so cute um it's from the 100 club and I thought I'd also like write out my routine for the morning so I'm just gonna be doing that on Notion. First on the agenda is to make myself some dinner. I have some tofu that needs eaten and vegetables. I have my favorite yellow curry paste. And I think I have some coconut milk as well. This is kind of what I'm going to be chopping up. An onion, some garlic, two sweet potatoes, carrots, and then I'll add some kale in later. And for my company this evening, since I'm alone, I'm going to listen to Sophia's podcast. Super chill. I just love her vibes and it honestly just feels like I'm on FaceTime with her. Hello and welcome to Paradise. My name is Sophia. I am your host. Hey guys, welcome to me trying to be that girl for the morning. From what I've watched, that girl is productive. She does things to better herself and her health and make the most of the day. But I hope these kind of routines can be seen as inspiration rather than comparison. Online, that girl looks like she's living her most aesthetic life, but 
you know, pretty pictures doesn't mean productivity, and also productivity isn't everything. It's summer. If you're doing what you love or working towards a higher version of yourself, I think you're that girl. Anyway, back to the routine. We're starting off with the most important step, of course, is drinking lemon water. Um, I actually really like lemon water, and now that it's hotter in London, I've been having lemon water over ice. I was just drinking this and reading a bit of my book. I just finished Breakfast at Tiffany's, which I had never read before. Okay, next on the agenda is to move my body in some form, whether that's do a small workout inside or go for a run. I decided to go for a run today because it was super sunny outside. Went around St. James's Park, saw Buckingham Palace, there she is. I always just feel so much better if I move my body, whether it's going for like a walk or just anything. And then I can immediately get into the shower and do my skincare so I'm clean and fresh for whatever is to come. Actually getting ready for me makes such a difference. I find it so hard to work from home if I'm wearing sweats or whatever I'm sleeping in. On days I'm going out, I usually put on just a little bit of SPF, brow gel and blush to make myself feel a bit more put together. favorite parts of the morning is doing a little bit of journaling or brain dump. I usually write out my top tasks or intentions for the day. Sometimes I just like write out my thoughts or dreams or whatever is going on in my head but if I don't really know what to write I'll do like a short gratitude list and you know there's always something to be grateful for. Then I get started on answering emails, doing any admin, replying to people that I haven't replied to and just planning the rest of my day out. And this might be my favorite part of my routine is to try something new. Today I've decided to do some drawing. I used to love doing art when I was younger and in school and I just kind of got out of touch with it. So I got myself a sketchbook and some pencils and I've just been playing around in the morning for like 20, 30 minutes and still a little bit self-conscious about it. Um, definitely need to practice a bit more, but it's really nice to exercise that part of the brain again. And then normally I would make myself some food about now, but my parents were actually in town, which I was so grateful for. So I met up with them for breakfast at Tishoom. They have such a good vegan menu. Um, my dad got the vegan breakfast and I just got some granola. And then we kind of just shared, those vegan sausages are so good. Oh my gosh, I'm just like drooling about them right now. Um, but that was such a lovely little breakfast. And then 12 p.m. back to work. I guess this is kind of like the end of my morning. Um, but I really feel like I kind of set myself up for the day. Thank you guys so much for watching, sending lots of love as always and don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already.